Greater Victoria, Canada's gateway to the Pacific Rim. Only a half hour flight from major Northwest markets in Vancouver and Seattle, and linked to worldwide markets by air, sea, telecommunications, and the internet. Canada's mildest climate, the Garden City, a place of year-round outdoor activities, the capital of British Columbia, with a regional population approaching 350,000. Greater Victoria is a region of economic opportunity with a rapidly growing knowledge-based economy. A major tourist destination, Greater Victoria's tourism industry last year generated 1.3 billion in regional economic impact while advanced technologies last year became the region's leading economic generator, with annual revenue exceeding 1.7 billion. Advanced technologies cover a wide range of activities. There is Viking Air, which produces state-of-the-art aircraft, while Scott Plastics produces a variety of packaging products for global markets. At Scott Plastics, we manufacture a range of sports fishing, marine, outdoor and firefighting products and send our products all over the world. IT is Greater Victoria's fastest growing industry. The Vancouver Island Advanced Technology Centre, Viatech, represents 1,100 technology companies employing 15,000 people. Viatech is headquartered at the Vancouver Island Technology Park, Silicon Valley North. The tech park annually contributes nearly 280 million to British Columbia's economy. We have a strong venture capital community. We have a strong environment for entrepreneurial success. We have a proven track record and we have a, a strong university and college system that supports those new ideas. And with the couple with the tech park, we're able to commercialize those ideas into the marketplace. The technology park is an important part of the region's knowledge-based economy. It is owned and operated by the University of Victoria. UVic is Vancouver Island's largest learning institution with 12 faculties and divisions. The University of Victoria directly and indirectly supports over 11,000 jobs and generates $1.77 billion annually in economic activity. And what the university does is it attracts some of the best minds in the world, both students, faculty and staff, to come to this region. And once they're here, they're available to uh, serve the community more broadly uh, as employees, as consultants, as people that generate new ideas and new businesses that are going to improve the social, cultural and economic environment for everybody in this region. Victoria's education system is diverse and extensive. Picturesque Royal Roads University provides innovative access to domestic and overseas students, many seeking graduate degrees. Camosun College offers academics such as business, communications, and nursing at its Heritage Lansdowne campus, and skills and industry-based training on its growing campus on Interurban. Nearly 40,000 students attend Greater Victoria's post-secondary institutions, where fully 62% of Greater Victoria residents have a post-secondary education. Greater Victoria is situated on Vancouver Island, but transportation is not a problem. Regular ferry routes allow for speedy access to mainland destinations, while air links make travel even faster. Total visitors, 3.6 million annually, 1.35 million by air transport. This is the new economy, and it requires connections by air uh, around the world. So the convenience of our airport and convenience of our terminal building is really key to this community. Another facet of transportation, Victoria shipyards employ over 700 and annual economic activity is reaching the one billion dollar mark in this sector. Nearly a billion dollars was spent last year in new construction, often with green sustainable building practices. Victoria is rated Canada's healthiest and fittest city. Sporting facilities are numerous. Greater Victoria is the home of 26 18-hole golf courses, as well as 18 public recreation and training centers. You can try and time it is Beauty, 
diversity and heritage draw people from around the world to come to see Greater Victoria's architecture, gardens, and world-class attractions, such as Craig Derrick Castle and Bouchard Gardens. For those seeking adventure, sport and adventure tourism alone is undergoing double-digit annual growth. Whale watching is a must-see. Of the visitors who come to Greater Victoria on an annual basis, 1.9 million come by car on ferries from mainland BC and Seattle, while over 390,000 come during over 200 cruise ship visits that make southern Vancouver Island a port of call en route to Alaska. The city's inner harbor is a jewel, surrounded by beautiful heritage classics such as the elegant Fairmont Empress Hotel. There are 341 hotels in Greater Victoria with over 7,000 rooms. There are many fine restaurants and, of course, heritage treasures such as Totem Park and the Royal British Columbia Museum. Many visitors journey to Vancouver Island to attend meetings at the Victoria Conference Centre, a facility that hosts 110,000 delegate days a year and is now expanding its capacity. The city also boasts the oldest Chinatown in North America. There's Government Street, lined with attractive shops, big and small, to meet the demands of tourism and a strong domestic market. Greater Victoria has over 17,000 businesses with every service needed for a new business to establish itself and thrive. The business climate is um, it's very dynamic and it's starting to be a, a far more a collective uh, environment because we've got an economic development office and it's working on behalf of everyone in, in Victoria in the Central Regional District. And we're starting to see a lot more bigger businesses come to Victoria because it is easier to enter into the marketplace. Greater Victoria's local GDP exceeds $11.5 billion per year. Retail sales exceed $3.9 billion. KPMG ranked Greater Victoria as the number two place to do business in the Pacific Northwest. The Conference Board of Canada gives Greater Victoria an A for its business climate and quality of life. A place where the old and new work hand in hand. Greater Victoria. Canada's Pacific Gateway, with its gates wide open, a natural place to do business. For more information, please contact the Greater Victoria Development Agency.